Johnny Punk is back for 2024? What? <laughs> if I thought you guys were mad that I bought two terror dogs, I can only imagine how you feel finding out that I bought two Johnny Punks. That's right, guys. You heard it correctly. Johnny Punk is coming out of retirement for 2024. Okay, that's a stretch. Maybe not so in the stores. And you guys know I already own one. But I was online the other day doing some shopping, looking for some props, and I came across another Johnny Punk brand new in the box on Mercari, and I knew right then and there I had to buy it. He's only the greatest spirit prop ever, duh. Seriously though, I don't know why. Sometimes I just do these things, and I had so much fun with Johnny Punk when he was available in stores. But not only did I buy one, but yes, I was online the other day searching around looking for something, looking at what kind of props were available, and I did. I came across Johnny Punk, brand new in a box, so I made an offer and I bought him. Not only that, but it just so happens that when I bought him, I found out he came from a fan. So with this Johnny Punk comes some awesome fan mail. <laughs> so guys, we are going to unbox this Johnny Punk right here. We're gonna set him up, but first we're gonna look at this awesome fan mail. Look at this, it is chock full of stuff in there. <laughs> look at this, we have Spirit Halloween blind bag sticker edition. It's graded on the back. Okay, let's see what stickers we have here. What is it? Look, it's it's a Nate guy sticker. That's one of my favorites too, where I'm carving the pumpkin. And look at this guy. <laughs> and then we have colors on the back to grade the stickers. So you look at the colors on the back and then you match them up to the grade right there on the blind bag packaging. Very cool. We have another blind bag here, sticker edition. All right, let's see what's in here. Jack Skellington, I'm your nightmare. Oh, Michael Myers. Saw, you want to play a game? And who is this spooky fellow? It's like a mini Oogie Boogie. We have another blind bag. <laughs> Look at this. I that looks like heckles with his balloon. And we have some more little drawings there. One more blind bag. Look at this, we have poor George. <laughs> and I'm gonna guess this is Shorty because it looks like he's wearing boxing gloves. And then we have a note. Hi, I am Lily. I am a big fan. I am subscribed and we have some jack-o'-lanterns there. Well, thank you, Lily, so very much for your awesome little fan mail package. And thank you so much for making Johnny Punk available. Let's go unbox him. Okay guys, I'll tell you what, I don't know why I'm so excited to unbox a second Johnny Punk. I guess because I have plans for the other one, which you'll just have to stick around and see, but let's go ahead and get this one unboxed. You all know who Johnny Punk is, so we don't need to really look at the box and read up all about him. Here's his instructions. I do seem to remember that he was kind of a pain in the butt to put together. All right, we got his clothes. There's his power cord. Yeah, no wonder I couldn't get him back in the other box. This stuff is just jammed in here. All right, we got the hip hoop. Oh my gosh, how do you even get it out? There's his shoulders, one leg. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Wow, that stuff was just jam-packed in there. There'd be no way to ever get him back in this box and close it. Okay, I'm starting to have flashbacks from the first time I put him together. Everything is a jumbled mess in here. Oh my gosh. How did they ever even get him in here in the first place? There's Johnny's head. There's a shoe. What is that? What the heck? Something. There's another shoe. What is that? Clothes, his base, his arms. The arms and the base of the swing are all connected here with ropes. We got a crossbar here. Stay back, evil dog. Oh, all right. Okay, I had to get a couple of things prepared here, but we are ready to put Johnny together. So the first thing we do, we need to get his pants. I guess that would make sense. You want to put your pants on first thing in the morning. What are we putting the pants on? There's not even any legs or a butt yet. 
Okay, Velcro goes on behind the control box. <clears throat> Very strange, but okay, whatever. Next, we put the legs on. Okay. Do we go, do we go down or do we go up? All right, there's one. And two. Okay, legs are on. Next, this thing. Insert torso frame into the swing with control box. Pull the pants up over the waist hoop. We haven't put the waist hoop on yet. Okay, waist hoop. Arms out of the way. Wait, that wasn't right. Okay, this is the waist hoop. What the heck? That goes somewhere. I'm glad I plugged these other things in first. Because once you get his butt in place, you'd have to reach up in there. Never mind. All right, waist hoop, hip hoop, or whatever this thing's called. Oh, boy. Jacket. Okay. Arms in the jacket. Hope this is right. Just like this. I don't know. There's one arm. I can't even get my hand up in the sleeve because it's so small. Oh, Johnny. Beginning to remember why I don't like you. I'm going to need a mental health day after this. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, my gosh. That's it. I'm calling off tomorrow. Okay. Hook this in here. Hook this in here. That's not right. I gotta take the stupid arm back out. Officially never want to put together a Johnny Punk again. Close the hoodie and put the head on. That's not right. <laughs> we have to put the shoulder form on first. Shoulder form is on. What the heck? There's so many little hooks. That's the sensor. I thought the stupid hoodie was on inside out for a minute. I was gonna kick him to the curb and go. I'm about to feed Johnny to the terror dogs. All right, there's the head. Oh, Johnny, I can't stand you. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry, Johnny. Everybody deserves a chance at life. Okay. Who you calling a clown? You don't know who you're messing with. <laughs> I've been waiting for you to come out and play. What took you so long? <laughs> you were stuck in a box. You made a big mistake coming over here. I'll give you a three second head start to get lost. One, two, three. He officially has the corniest phrases of any animatronic ever. Who you calling a clown? You don't know who you're messing with. <laughs> oh, Johnny, why do I like you so much? I've been waiting for you to come out and play. What took you so long? <laughs> Is that it? I think he only says four phrases, right? Well, guess what? I got a phrase for you. What are those? All right, let's take a good look at Johnny here as if we've never seen him before. We got the what are those shoes. We got the pants. We got the hoodie. We got the clown face. And these arms, let me just tell you, I was about to rip these things off and feed them to the terror dogs because these are the most ridiculous arms Ever. Like, I couldn't get them in place, right? There's these wires inside here that just bend all over the place and stretch. If it weren't for those stupid arms, he would be so much easier to put together. All right, let's hear him one more time. A big mistake coming over here. I'll give you a three-second head start to get lost. One, two, three. Now, if he were a jump scare prop, right at that point he would yell and jump straight at your face. But they didn't do that, they just made him a swinging idiot. Who you calling a clown? Okay, a you clown. <laughs> <laughs> One more. I've been waiting for you to come out and play. What took you so long? <laughs> I hate that laugh so much. All right, so I guess it's only three phrases. All right, well, there he is, guys. One last look at Johnny Punk, everyone's favorite spirit animatronic. <laughs>
He's going to hang out there with the terror dogs. And if you guys haven't watched those videos, watch the videos of the terror dogs. These things are absolutely enormous. I put both of these together in one video. And then I put up another video because a lot of people were talking about the price. Because these did cost $600 each. And that is pretty pricey. However, I don't think people really realize just how enormous these things are. Look at this thing. It looks like it wants to chew my face off right now. Ah! 